Hallo und herzlich willkommen, liebe Medienvertreter, liebe Kollegen, zur abschließenden Pressekonferenz nach dem Heimspiel der Adler Mannheim gegen den ERC Ingolstadt. Der Endstand vor 10.132 Zuschauern, 2 zu 1 aus Sicht der Adler. Hier oben auf dem Podium begrüße ich die beiden Cheftrainer zu meiner rechten, Ingolstadt-Trainer Mark French und zu meiner linken Adlercoach Johann Lundskog. Und auch heute beginnen wir natürlich mit dem Gästetrainer. Mark, your statement, please. Thank you. Um, well, first, just like to congratulate uh, Mannheim on the win. Uh, yeah, you know, I, I think always a tough building to play and starts are important. Um, you know, they were able to get the, the first goal and um, we were a little bit obviously fortunate to, to be able to, to get the shorthanded goal that we did to, to even it up. And then I thought it was a, a pretty tight game um, for the rest of the, the, two, the two periods, the second and third. Um, you know, I thought we did some good things offensively, made some, made some pushes. Um, their goaltender played a strong game. Uh, we didn't capitalize uh, around the net. But at the same time, Mannheim had some really good opportunities back the other way. Um, I thought they made a good push after they scored the second goal. I thought, um, you know, that was probably our weakest phase, and I thought they pushed. So we saw a little bit of a sag, but then I thought we righted ourselves pretty well after that and had some good chances down the stretch to even it up. And, you know, again, I thought their goalie was good. They had some timely blocks, and we weren't able to, to find the equalizer. Thank you, Mark. Johan, your statement. Thank you. Thank you, Mark. It was a great, great hockey game at the end of the day. I think we're uh, happy with the way we came out. We knew they were going to be a desperate team, and, and you know, I uh, wanted to make sure that we had a good good push out the gate here and uh felt like felt like we did. Uh got the early goal like you said and uh, gave up a uh, a shorty there but uh happy to see Arno bounce back the way he did after that. You know, he was he, he made the saves he had to make there and then and, and some some real big ones for us over the course of the game there. Uh, very very happy with our group's ability to to push, you know, we were short shorthanded going into the game and we became even shorter when Schwartzy left obviously there. So, you know, the guys dug deep and they were able to to push the pace there for 60 minutes. So very, very proud of just uh, the, the effort that the boys put, put in today and stuck with it for 60 minutes and uh, got rewarded for it uh, just like we did in Bremerhofen the other night. I think we found our way back to looking uh, close to what we want to look like on a regular basis here this week. So happy to move forward from here. Thank you, Johann. So viel zu den Statements der beiden Cheftrainer. Gibt es an dieser Stelle Fragen aus der Runde? Philipp Köhl vom Mannheimer Morgen, bitte. Hello, Johann. Um, you said it. Jordan Swartz was out today. Uh, every game, uh, last couple of games, an injury. How will you handle this situation? I mean, it's, it's next man up. I mean, that's why we, we have a deep roster and, uh, you know, uh, we're. Uh, Got to dig a little bit deeper here and, and make sure that the guys step up. And I think the, the younger guys most certainly did so here in the last two games. Really, really happy with the way uh, Yannick Prosk has come in and, and performed in the two games since he since he joined our team. And uh, Teeler as well has played played great here. So you know this is what we need from, from throughout the whole room. the lineup is guys you know stepping into new roles and bigger roles and, and doing a good job doing so. So uh, full credit to those guys. Gibt es weitere Fragen an dieser Stelle? Sieht nicht danach aus. Dann bedanke ich mich für die Aufmerksamkeit. Danke auch an beide Coaches. Mark, for you and your team, safe travels back to Ingolstadt. All the best for the upcoming games. Wir sehen uns dann am kommenden Freitag wieder nach dem Auswärtsspiel in der CHL hier in der SAP Arena. Das ist der 20. Oktober. Dann geht es gegen Nürnberg. 19.30 Uhr fällt das erste Bulli. Euch allen noch einen schönen Sonntagabend und einen guten Start in die neue Woche. Bis dann. <lacht>